morning guys uh, this setup here I'm running the same road and again uh, my PC boards underneath any 55 timers driving one road and coil the other two coils are in parallel there's uh, 790 volt spikes coming out of those two that go back over here to uh, uh, a ceramic donut uh, step down transformer about 210 turns to 50, 17 gauge on one end, and 26 gauge on the other. Uh, that goes to a bridge rectifier diode back to the battery. And we've been running at, uh, let me see here, 12.4, mean, peak to peak is 1 to 1.2, minimum 12 to 11.8, uh, and then 13 volts maximum. And it's been at that now for over two hours running the whole system. And I know that it's drawing about uh, 90, 95 uh, milliwatts of power to run it. Because I had, uh, so anyway, but what I don't have connected, I don't have the uh, high voltage cap connected to the center donut coil yet. I just wanted to see, see this thing continue to run uh, at, you know with with this setup and uh, what I did with the ceramic donut I took a Dremel tool and about 10 15 blades and cut it in half so I could get the coils on there easy without doing a hand wind and that seemed to work awesome uh, with no battery connection to the cap over here I'm getting 20 volts at the cap and uh, one of the next steps will be to substitute uh, these caps here in this, uh, this these are like 500 farad caps 2.7 volts in series so there's two groups of six there just use those in place of the battery so once we eliminate the battery and have this thing self self-sustaining like it is right now uh, man I, I don't know all hell should break loose anyway have a good day